Let's take a look at where we should be for this time of year. Normal high about 85. We are actually going to surpass that once again, but the dew points are going to be lower. The record set back on this day, 1933, 66, uh, 96 degrees. Look at 51 degrees. How delightful that would be. Set back in 1977. Typical overnight low 63. We're actually pretty close to that. All right, we're talking about a potential tropical cyclone number nine. Uh, this is, uh, there are tropical storm warnings already in effect for uh, Dominican Republic and Haiti and Puerto Rico, and uh, it is expected to ride to the north and hit Florida as a tropical storm, possibly by this weekend. So we're keeping an eye on it for you. Uh, once it gets named, I'll let you know it's Isaisis. It's a difficult name to pronounce. So I'm giving it my best shot there. Uh, Torrington, uh, it, no threat to Connecticut at this time. We'll certainly let you know if that uh, moves into Florida this weekend. Torrington, good morning. Look at that. Isn't that absolutely beautiful? Wow. Look, look at this. It's like glowing. a picture. It's glowing. Hartford, good morning to you. All right, so it's a great start out there. We've got uh, temperatures out there in the uh, mid to upper 60s, lower 70s along the shoreline. Little bit of scattered shower activity over the twin forks of Long Island, but nothing affecting us. We've got partly to mostly clear skies. The temperatures are cooperating once again, 63 at Bradley, exactly where we should be. Actually, a little bit below average. When was the last time I said that? 61 in Salisbury, 61 in Torrington. You've got 64 in Waterbury, 65 in Danbury. Remember, 63 is the number you should be seeing here. Now, in terms of our dew points, not too bad. Upper 50s, 57 for Salisbury, 59 for Torrington, 57 for Putnam. These are some pretty delightful dew points considering where we've been. So it's a great start. We are expecting mostly sunny skies today. Now it's going to be hot. Don't get me wrong, temperatures are going to be pushing into the low 90s. However, those dew points are going to be coming down. Relative humidity is going to be fairly comfortable. So we've got that lower humidity for you, which is just awesome. And no storm threat today. It is to the west of Connecticut. So we're not going to be dealing with any lightning or thunder during the day today like we had yesterday for northeast and southeast Connecticut when those storms did go severe. Had a couple of storms to the south of Connecticut this morning. That's where they're going to stay. Uh, but we do have a little bit of a weak impulse over my shoulder here, and that's trying to race its way in towards us. So by tomorrow, we might have uh, some scattered showers, maybe a brief thunderstorm, but not today. As you can see, 12 o'clock, we're doing good. Tonight, I mean, it's showing a sprinkle. I doubt that's even going to happen. And then there's, as a cold front moves through, there might be an overnight shower tonight through very early tomorrow morning but it's really downplayed here on Futurecast. And then tomorrow during the day, we have that chance for a scattered shower or a thunderstorm, uh, but today should be pretty nice. Highs today, climb into the upper 80s and low 90s, mostly sunny, lower humidity, and then your seven day forecast includes a chance for a scattered shower or a thunderstorm tomorrow. 88 Friday dry, Saturday dry, Sunday a mm, little questionable at this point. We'll certainly keep you posted. And then a chance for shower and thunderstorm activity Monday and Tuesday. But the temperatures do come down a bit towards the latter part of that seven day forecast.